What's up everyone, it's Jamie here from Shopify Masterclass and today we're going to cover the best Shopify email marketing tool for 2021 and this marketing tool is something that covers everything you need. When you want email marketing, I'm not talking about cold email where you're reaching out to people you don't know, I'm talking about email marketing for building those relationships with your customers and with your soon-to-be customers, ones that have interacted with your website and provided their email. Maybe it was an exchange for a coupon code, maybe they did one of those wheel pop-up things. These customers have already given you email and this is where you contact them. A lot of marketing is defined by the right message at the right time. And this email marketing app is really good at doing that. It has lots of segmentation, the ability to message the customers at the right time. Before we get into it, I just want to quickly thank our sponsor. Discover ProfitCalc, the affordable and easy to set up Shopify app that crunches your numbers in just one click. It automatically syncs with all your accounts and expenses to calculate your profit, displaying everything in an easy to read dashboard so you understand your business in real time. Start for free on the Shopify app store today. All right, so here it is. The best email marketing app for Shopify in 2021 is Klaviyo. Klaviyo is definitely one of the biggest out there. They have over 50,000 subscribers and lots of integrations and lots of, lots of custom features for Shopify merchants. So amazing things here are like the customization for the flows and the automation. So this is the overall marketing message here. So this is just their app listing. Just to give you an idea of what it looks like and the customization here. I'm just gonna scroll into my test Klaviyo account that I set up. And so when you open it up, you get your Klaviyo marketing and your Klaviyo setups. And so one of the best things about this is the flows and the analytics. So you can really segment customers, be like, if customers purchased more than $100, more than $250, I wanna segment them into this flow. One setup I've always had is a repurchase email. So after the customer purchases, you might wanna put them in a sequence to, see, to get them to buy again. Cause you know it's always more cheaper to get an existing customer to buy again than to acquire a new customer. So a repurchase flow might be a thank you email, then maybe it's 20 days later, you're messaging them again saying, hey, like we think this product would be really good with a product you just bought. Here it is, here's another discount code. Another one is a recovery email. So after 60 to 90 days, after the customer has gone through the purchase cycle, you wanna get them again. Because for many customers, it's out of sight and out of mind. All right, so let's go into Klaviyo and just get an idea of the flows and the features and the pre-built automations and the templates that they have. So as I go from here, you can have campaigns which are one-off emails you send to everyone. This could be a certain list of 500 people per se. You can email them and then get them all at a certain date. So that's why you wanna message them on Tuesday at 8 p.m. There's that. One of my favorite parts of Klaviyo though is the flows. So these flows are automatically triggered by what a customer does on the website. For example, a one every store should have is an abandoned cart flow. So when someone starts their checkout and enters their email, but maybe leaves because they have to go do something around the house, they get a phone call and they get a chance to purchase your product. These customers have the intent to buy something. So you wanna get them quickly as possible and back into the purchase sequence. So these flows here, you can set it up, you can add delays. So this one is wait four hours. Maybe I wanna set it to 30 minutes after they are enter the flow, just to get them really quickly. It makes it really easy to drag and drop all your flows and the email sequences are pre-built in a lot of cases they have a lot of good templates so you don't have to do too much setup on your end so when you go into the email preview you have this section here so you can set the subject line and you can edit the content Klaviyo does have a good email template creator or content editor it makes it easy you don't need to know any custom code you can just kind of drag and drop and input items here and they also have a good integration with Shopify, so you can get the product title, the quantity, and the price without having to manually input it yourself. You can also do stuff like change the color of the button, change the styling. Overall, it's a good content email creator. It's not maybe the best I've seen out there, but it's very effective for what it is. It was very good at getting the right content at the right time versus having maybe a beautiful email template editor. And if you really are going for those customized email templates, you might want to hire someone to create a custom one as well. Another strong part of Klaviyo is their analytics. So they give you really good analytics as they have a direct integration with Shopify to so your delivery rate, your open rate, how many people place an order. So you get an idea of how effective these flows are and how much money Klaviyo is generating you on a monthly basis.
Another benefit of Clavio is that it does have strong integrations. Because it is such a large brand and an established brand, they have integrations with quite a few things. So Amazon Marketplace, Chargebee, Facebook Advertising, Help Scout, they allow you to tag certain things based on customer interactions because they have all these integrations. For example, you might create a high value lookalike audience in fit Facebook directly through your Clavier integration. It can see how many customers spent more than $300 and it can maybe take all those customers and create a custom audience in Facebook, which can then let you create a lookalike audience, which can be very powerful for bringing in all that data into one place and using it for further marketing. The biggest con I'd have with Clavio is that it can be quite expensive, especially if you have a large email list, such as if you have an email list of 10,000 contacts, it's $150 a month, which would be quite expensive over the year. The justification for that though, is that Clavio can have a very calculable return on investment. So if you go to the dashboard, you can see how much Clavio is generating and it can give you an idea of if you're generating $2 for every $1 you put into Clavio, that's a good return on investment. So it is justified there. It's also an incentive to clean your contacts, so you don't want a bunch of outdated contacts that you're never using, so you can go through and clean that as well. So that concludes my review on the best email marketing app for Shopify. I would encourage you to download it, check it out. It's free to start. It's just mainly a very easy to set up email marketing tool, it has a lot of automatic integrations out of the box, and the flows are excellent. And a lot of these flows, you can just set it, split test it, and leave it for a while, come back and change it every once in a while. But once you get those flows set up, they keep on working for you. You don't have to pay attention to when a customer adds something to their cart or when they subscribe to their email sequence or even their post-purchase upsell sequence. The Clavio does that all automatically once you have set up and it's very easy to use, very intuitive, and it's been around for a long time and has a lot of customers and a lot of integrations already built because it's been around for so long. If you like this video, just leave a like below. If you have any questions, leave a comment as well. And if you haven't yet, please subscribe.